Spurgeon here with Revzilla, and today we are taking a look at the Climb Arsenal vest available at Revzilla.com. So for you enduro riders out there that want to take the weight off of your motorcycle and attach it to your persons, the Climb Arsenal vest is going to be a fully adjustable vest which allows you to keep your tools, your gear with you on an enduro ride. Now, this is going to be a one size fits all option. One color available and that's the night camo. To give you an idea of how this fits, Juice on my left hand side stands at 5 foot 10, weighs in at 195 pounds and has a 42 inch chest and we're going to have this ratcheted down pretty nicely so it's going to work for a wide variety of different riders out there with maximum adjustability. So the Arsenal vest is going to be for you enduro riders out there that do want to keep the weight on you as opposed to on the bike. And we know Climb at Revzilla because Climb is really known for their role in off-road adventure riding, enduro riding, and the different unique products they're creating to help riders out in a variety of different situations. So for you enduro riders out there that are looking for something to give you maximum storage, this is going to be a nice option. It's going to fit over top of your already existing gear. So Juice on my left hand side is wearing this on top of the Climb Tactical Pro jersey. And you can see it works really nicely to give them a setup that's still going to allow for a ton of airflow, but it is going to be lighter than if you were wearing a full jacket with pockets inside of that. So let's break this down. The overall construction on this is going to be a heavy duty nylon with a maximum amount of 3D mesh. We're going to start with the front. We're going to work our, through, our way through that. We're going to talk about the sides and then work our way to the back as we take a look at this. So the first points of adjustments come in at the shoulder and you're going to see a nice big piece of nylon webbing at the top and you can really ratchet this down to adjust where this fits over your shoulder. And as you bring this down, you're going to see a hydration tube with a connection point on the front massive amounts of mesh throughout. It's a nice 3D mesh and you're going to see a lot of molly webbing throughout this too for different tie down points. And then you're also going to notice on this on either side you are going to have hidden pockets behind the mesh for extra storage there. And then you're going to have a little bit of asymmetry coming into play. You have a you have a nice fleece line pocket over on the left hand side. And what I like about the pockets is they hold their shape even when they're empty. So if you do have pieces in here that are a little bit more sensitive, you don't have to worry about them being smashed down or smushed down. There's a little bit of just overall, you know, uh, rigidity, if you will, to the pockets themselves. And as you take a look at the pockets, they're all going to be a water resistant pocket. None of the zips on this are going to be a water resistant zip. So you are not going to want to put any electronics in these. It's probably my one nitpick overall with the Arsenal vest is that I would have loved to have seen one pocket that was completely waterproof just if I wanted to carry my cell phone or any electronics on this. Now I do want to open up both pockets in the front just to show you this. They will both have Velcro strips on the inside. And then on the left hand pocket, you're going to see there is going to be a holster there. So if you do want to carry with you, you have that option for you. And much like we try to tell you if a backpack can hold a certain size laptop, uh, this will not be able to hold a Desert Eagle pistol just way too big and probably not something you want to carry on the ride. It's a massively heavy handgun. So as we wrap out the front, you do have three adjustment straps with this, which will again allow for further adjustment down the midsection. And Juice, just face to your right hand side and throw the hand up in the rider position for me. You're also going to notice three adjustment straps running down the torso on the body. Maximum amount of adjustments, so three straps in the front, three straps on either side, and then those shoulder straps really allow you to fine tune how this fits for you, and it really comes in with that one size fits all. Juice, you may face backwards for me. So as we work our way down the back, the first pocket you're going to come to is going to be a large pocket which is going to hold a hydration pack, and you're going to see anodized aluminum buckle at the top which is going to hold the hydration pack in there and in a nice holster so you're not going to have to worry about this moving around on you. And as we take a look at the inside of this, as we close that back up, working our way down, there'll be a separate pocket for storage on the back on the outside of the hydration pack. And then the last pocket you come to is going to be a completely removable tool pouch with this. So what I like about this is that you can take it off if you don't want to use it. Really easy to get on and off and you don't have to completely remove it to access your tools. And as you open this up, You'll notice that on the inside of this, you're going to have different compartments for wrenches, for screwdrivers, whatever you want to put in here, uh, tire pressure gauge, and then you're also going to have separate pockets if you want to include maybe uh, extra spare valve stems or you want to put you know, fuses in here. You do have separate pockets that you can actually partition different items off. The final thing that you'll notice on the back of this is we close this up and we strap this back down. On either side of the backpack itself, you're going to have massive panels or massive pockets running on each side and these are going to be perfect if you want to utilize longer tire irons. Pops for reflectivity on top of the night camo and as you open this up 
you'll see there is going to be elasticated webbing on the inside. And what this is going to be great for is you can put the tire iron in there. There's going to be a little pocket at the bottom where it would sit. And then you don't have to worry about it moving around. And there's one on either side. So if you're carrying two tire irons with you, you don't have to worry about them clinging and clanging into each other the entire time you're riding. Juice, you may face forward for me. And I'm going to just go ahead and unsnap this and pop open the right side so we can see just the inside of this. And what I really like about the inside of this, and you can see it's going to fit over top of that jersey really well, 3D mesh is going to really help to promote airflow throughout the entire piece. And it's also going to help just wick sweat away and pull it off of the body, maximizing comfort on warmer rides. Juice, you may strap up. Now, I will say this, the Climb Arsenal vest is not for everyone. Personally, when I am riding off-road, I like to keep all of my tools in a small pouch on the motorcycle. I don't like having the weight on my persons. What I will say for this is there's a lot of riders out there that I ride with that like the idea of a hydration pack. You've got full three liters of water that you can carry with you on this. Keep all your tools nice and close to your person and get that weight off the bike. That's really who this is aimed at. And there's a lot of riders out there utilizing climb gear on their rides. And if you want to know more about what their thoughts are on the climb gear that they're rocking, you can always click the info button on your desktop or mobile device, which will allow you to read other rider reviews from folks that are already out there using the Climb Arsenal vest on their motorcycles. More questions for our gear geeks, give them a shout at 877-792-9455, or simply shoot us an email, cs at revzilla.com. Thank you for joining us for this look at the Climb Arsenal vest. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.